everybody welcome to your daily PSA I've been missing for a minute because I've been working really hard um, I just got assigned to um, editor staff editor and head writer for my department and they're assigning me a team so I'm very excited about that and like we're doing like a whole bunch of like awesome things for how do you so we're go we're great. Um I'm happy because you know tomorrow's the big two nine. Yes, tomorrow's my birthday. I shall be tw turning twenty nine. Yes, um shout out to my little sister Kimmy. Her birthday was Monday, but I already told her that since we lived together, but you know, she knows. But um you know, our birthdays fall in the same week, which is awesome. And um you know, this is the year, the season of the Scorpio, so yes, and it's awesome because my birthday is 11, 11, 11. <laughs> that's, 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 that's pretty, it's pretty, pretty neat. But anyway, um, I'm sorry I haven't made any videos. I've been that like, terribly busy. I've been just, just working hard and t trying to make this money, you know, doing what I can, and I am so sorry for not getting on like I should be doing and so I decided to come on today um, yes okay but anyway um, I I want to have a girl talk series today and um, let me go look at the question right for you guys right quick ew Hey, what's the, don't you hate when you get these touch screen phones and no matter how much you clean the darn screen, it gets dirty? Okay, hold on. I have to log in so I can get the questions for you guys. Okie dokies. All right, here we go. What? Ooh. Okay. What is your view on dependability? Meaning, as of friends or relationships wise. Ooh, excuse me. As as ooh, excuse me. As relationship wise, and friendship wise dependability I always have a friend that I depend like okay she's saying that she has a friend that she they hang out with each other and it's like promise after promise promise too many open promises how do I deal with that and what are your views on it okay me with that there's you know why don't you just be nice about it and just say yo listen stop with the empty promises you know it's just it's just too much to handle and it's just not fair on me together Hold up, hold the fuck up, I'm going soft. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. D you know what, as me, I'm going to be honest with y'all right now. There's one thing in this world that I do not like when people give me empty promises. If you're going to say you're going to do something, you're going to do it. Hold your end, up, end of, the bargain to, of the bargain, okay? Don't leave me hanging on the edge of the ladder about to fall off when you're already at the top. Help me, you know, babe, give me some slack, you know what I mean? It's one thing that I really can't stand. I get pissed off about it. Okay, I never liked that, you know. You know, you tell somebody you're going to do something, and you get their hopes up, and then all of a sudden, it just crashes to the ground. I'm like, why would you do that? Think ahead, a plan before you tell me something to do something. Disappointment, you know, and you disappoint somebody like that, that hurts, like, a lot. Think about what the fuck you're going to do and say for somebody, if you're going to do it before you do it. 
okay don't say one minute oh we're gonna do this that and then the next minute the promises break and stuff like that that fucking hurts people people need to learn that shit it's not right it's not fair to you and your feelings okay friendships relationships get strained because of shit like this i keep telling people i'm like don't make promises you can't keep for real seriously i don't make no fucking promise to nobody that i can't keep i don't promise nobody shit seriously because if i know i can't do it i'm not gonna fucking do it i'm not gonna say i'm gonna do say I'm, if i want to say okay i'm gonna do this i'm gonna do it but if i know i can't do it i'm not gonna tell you i'm gonna I'm gonna do it. Cause you know why? The shit's not gonna fucking happen. So don't fucking tell me that we're gonna do shit and do this and that when it's not gonna fucking happen. That really pisses me off. And you know, I was going soft at first and I realized, wait a minute, hold on. No, 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 no. And this has been going, and she told me this has been going on for like years. Stand up and say some shit. Don't like have yourself hanging on the edge all the time knowing you're doing all this and they're just, just giving you the empty promises. Fuck that now. Say some shit, please. Please. People out there that's listening to me, empty promises, this shit, it's just, it's, it's, it's whack, it's old, it's played out. Don't, don't promise people shit, you know what I'm saying? Shit, and I know sometimes shit don't fall through because of other shit that happens and there's legitimate excuses, I know. But sometimes, excuse after excuse after excuse after excuse, it just builds up and it starts to make your credibility not so good. So... Try not to promise people shit when you can't promise it, okay? Alright. Thank you. Okay. But anyway, that's my um, girl talk series for the day. And, um, uh, I need to get some more questions and stuff up for you guys. So if you want to, just inbox me and I'll be happy to do it. Don't worry, guys. I love you and I shall talk to you later. Bye.